Yeah, y'all see that new intro image? You know what that is, and you know what this is, obviously. I want to welcome you, you guys. This is my first Call of Duty commentary, and you know who it is. It's getting. Let's get it popping. Let's see what it does. All right. So, this is my first commentary. Let me introduce myself as a Call of Duty player. So, let's talk about, in this video, what I'm running with. Right now, I'm running with the AK-47. That's the Andre Karolinko. Okay? So... AK-47, it used to suck, right? And that was a grenade fail. Got that right. Um, it used to suck. When the first, like when Call of Duty first came out, the first couple of months, it was a beast gun. The gun was a monster gun, you know? But for whatever reason, they dumbed it down. They really nerfed it. Now, I play with it. This is like months of not playing with the gun. And, you know, this is my first run, really, really with it. So, my analysis on this gun is... It's great mid-range to close range. If you get the jump on everybody, close range you'll kill them all the time. But you know, you gotta feather the trigger. You can't just squeeze it. Spray and pray. You really can't do that so much with the game. You see that shit? You see that shit? I'm sorry. But do you see that shit? Two guys on last stand? Come on man, that's that's uh that's a pussy perk, man. Stop being a vagina. Anyway, so what I will run with with the AK-47 is extended mags or dual clip i would rather just do um extended mags you see how like my gun didn't waver at all with the ak-47 it doesn't do that andre karolinko gun it doesn't do that for whatever reason it stays still it doesn't waver when you have multiple targets on the screen that's a really good reason why i use this gun or i used it or why i like it anyway so i got a stem extended mags on this joint now my perks for this particular game, I got uh, I got Lightweight Pro, because I like to run and jump around, as you're going to see sooner or later. I like to run, jump around, so you move quicker. Good. Um, my second perk is not sleight of hand, it's steady aim. Why am I using steady aim if I don't have a Uzi or a light machine gun? This is why. My playstyle, I run a lot. I don't camp. I'm not a pussy like that. I may hold down a position strategically, but you'll never see me camp. That's what I always will bring to you fine people who watch my video. You'll never see me camp, okay? I'm not a vagina like that. I play the game. The game doesn't play me. Anyway, so you got my second perk, steady aim. Because when you're running, steady aim pro, the gun comes up real quick. It doesn't, it's like non-existent the time, the time between you running and you pick up the gun totally quick last perk is always going to be my last perk every single time it's going to be marathon pro i run i do what i do you get me i'm a rush i rush that gets me a lot of deaths i don't care i'm playing domination i'm playing the objective and for me to bring you guys uh some color commentating color commentating some commentary and Call of Duty, the gameplay to me has to be somewhat entertaining because I can't, you know, it's not just going to be me. It's going to be me, my personality, plus my excellent gameplay, you know. And another thing, I don't use chopper gunner. I may use dogs every once in a while, but I don't use a chopper gunner. I don't use the other one, the Apache or whatever it is. I run around, I earn all my kills. If I get dogs, yeah, that's a big bonus. But for the most part, I do everything myself, all monk bullets. Either I'm running with scavenger or lightweight, for the most part. part. Alright, so, now, see how I just gunned down that guy that's at that mid-range level. Destroy people like that with the, um, with the Andre Karolinko. Look at this noob just standing there. He doesn't know how to press the trigger button. Anyway, so... Like I say, I played the I played the objectives. I, I didn't see that guy come down because I was probably looking at my radar. It's all good. So this guy's shooting me from afar. You see how far it is? I really can't get the kill. I get the assist. Somebody else killed him. I really couldn't get the kill. AK-47, Andre Karolinko gun is definitely best. Mid-range to close range. So I see that they got B. I got killed at B. That's not going to deter me from getting my objective to help out my team looking at my radar everything is good 
Got it. Got B. Got the objective. Somebody throw a grenade. I want to say something. I got lightweight. This is something with explosions that you can run away from explosions a lot easier, even though if you're in the same vicinity. Somebody got a black bird up. Uh oh. Now it's time to really do damage. This is when I, this is when I rush the most. Is when they have a, a black bird up. This is when I kill. Go on a killing spree. You know, I'm not saying I'm the best Call of Duty player out there, but I'm telling you for sure, I'm definitely not a camper. You know, and I move strategically. I try to think, try to be smart with everything. So, gun him down. Look at that last stand, pussy perk. Come on, man. Stop being a vagina. Last stand, Ghost Pro. Ghost Pro plus silence weapons. See, look right there. Sorry, you know, to be everywhere, but I have lightweight. So, they threw a grenade. It was right by me. I ran away and I, I survived. There's something with lightweight and explosions, how you could escape explosions. I don't know what it is. But look at me beast that fool. Anyway, like I was saying, Ghost Pro and Silence Weapons, it's an unfair advantage. I don't care whatever the case is. All right, so this is why I like to use lightweight. All right, you're about to see something epic right here. Look at this. So this one dude kills two of my boys. I got to get my revenge on him. And since he did that, I got all oh, that brought, brought out the beast in me. I knew they were taking B. I'm running like a warrior. I am. Dive. That's right. Look at this. Look at this Tarzan impression. Superman impression. Lightweight pro. You don't get hurt. Look at this new. Die. Die. And you know what? Last stand. That's fine. I got you. I was about to stab him. He turns around. I start gun busting. Bucking him. Kill him. Oh, his boy want to... Do a little head glitch, try to run away. You ain't run away from my bullets. You lucky I ran out of bullets right here. I see that he trying to shoot me. I go and cover, reload, and explode on that asshole. <laughs> Look at him with his legs open, waiting for me to fuck him. Oh, that's a vagina perk, man. That last stand is a pussy ass perk. Damn. Yup, that was the highlight right there. All right, so I'm doing pretty good. I don't you see. I don't really check my stats that much because I'm trying to give you action-packed commentary. You know, I'm not gonna sit back, lay idle, or anything like that. I want you to be looking at the screen. Yeah, I died right there. The dude wounded me. It took two of them. Matter of fact, it took five of them, six of them to kill me. Okay, because I'm a beast. I'm a beast that time. When the internet is good, the no connection problem is a fair thing not host advantage i'm saying when it's an even playing i'm a beast and i turn into voltron when i do have host advantage so that's when i go like 50 and 60 and like 10 or 11 is, is ridiculous if i have host advantage right now the internet is on a constant basis level playing field right now so i see they got two uh two points they got the a flag the poppy the big flag big poppy flag we got the Chulo flag. <laughs> Shout out to my man, Big Poppy, man. He, he got some good videos. Try to get him some views so he can get more exposure. So I get the B flag right here. I believe. Yeah, I definitely get the B flag right here. Because that's what I do. I play the objective. That's not me camping right there. I'm getting the objective. Waiting for a fool to come down and think he's going to stop me. He ain't going to stop me. I do get shot in the back, though. That's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. But you think you're going to get B? I don't think so. See, right there, he should have shot me, but he didn't. He's too, too busy trying to get B. Not noticing that a beast is about to be awakened on him. Kill him in your last damn pussy. Oh, kill him. Oh, look at that. Look at that. See, I, I wipe it up, man. I do. This is what I do. I, I hold a fort down. I notice somebody's coming. He tried to noob to me like a noob he is. My boy comes on the side. You die. Don't try to jump my bullets. This is not Halo. I don't know what you. I don't know what people are doing lately. Look at this double kill. You see the gun doesn't waver. Andre Karolinko does not waver. You get me? That's why I like the AK-47. Great gun. Does not waver. Mid to close range. Gun on gun. You done, son. This guy. He, now he got me. He had his gun out already. He wasn't running. I was running, and there's still um, a disadvantage if you're running, even with uh, steady aim. That's another reason why I like steady aim, just to go back on that, expound upon it a little bit. Reason why I like steady aim: you can knife people 
twice real quick real quick look at this new why not why didn't he shoot me I uh, must be a little four-year-old or something like that I beast on the children's <laughs> anyway so he's gonna flash me he think he's gonna kill me nope definitely not this guy head glitching over there it's almost impossible to kill him kill his boy he's still shooting at me can't kill me this is at the end of the game and I don't care I'm a warrior I know they coming I'm still shooting end of the game you can't kill me yeah camping ass punk anyway so as you see we won I'm on the top of the list because I, I, I did a like maybe what three caps you about to see right now but I got my caps I got my defense I get mostly defense though whenever you see me play I get a lot of defense I went 31 13 no chopper gunner no dogs my boy Big Poppy 37 17 he did good I think he had a chopper gunner I'm not too sure he probably didn't and my other dude Burning Man 36 and 11 what more can you ask man that's a lot of beasting a lot of beasting we didn't have host advantage it was a level playing field and we beast on them dudes so this was my first commentator commentating commentary <laughs> yeah I mumbo a little bit that's how I do but anyway this is getting I'm not stepping in and out of no booth but I'm done playing Call of Duty for right now all right peace out people rate subscribe like it I'm out. Peace.